Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, depending on when you're watching this, and welcome to the Year 11 channel on Teams. This team will be used to share information that we get that is useful for your year group. I know that times are tough right now, and it's not being easy for anybody, but as students in an exam year, you guys have had a particularly raw deal. I want to congratulate you on your approach to the new remote learning that we've encountered. The majority of you are doing great. Attending live lessons has been good, and the work that has been submitted is of a good quality. By now, you will have had your mock results back. There's always a range of emotions when it comes to mock results, whether you're really pleased, pretty disappointed, or somewhere in between. I should remind you that these are not an endpoint. They are a platform for you to be able to build upon. One of the many downsides to not being in school is the lack of contact with your staff. I know a number of you are reconsidering your post-16 options. I urge you to get in touch with your teaching staff to see what you need to be able to do to access that next level, whether it's aiming for a grade four or a grade five or even a grade seven or above. Your staff know you and they know your abilities and they will be able to guide you in how to improve and advise you on any sixth form decisions that you are thinking of making. In terms of the future, well, there's still a lot of unknowns and there's quite a lot of uncertainty. The government are consulting with people about how your results will be calculated. And once that's been decided, I'll be able to update you some more. I would also love to welcome you all back into school as soon as possible. But it was announced that the earliest we can expect schools to begin reopening is on the 8th of March. So it's going to be a bit of time yet. The one thing that I know for sure is that the work that you put in between now and when you officially finish year 11 is massively important. You must continue to engage in the work being set. Keep attending all of the sessions that you can and getting involved with those lessons, not just letting it happen around you. If your staff don't have the evidence of you submitting work, then there is unlikely to be any improvement on any grades. I know full well it can be hard to motivate yourself. On some days, it's even tough just getting out of bed and getting in the shower. But getting yourself into a routine is key. See these next few weeks as an opportunity to improve and show everyone the potential that you have. The tutors have done a great job in getting in contact with you so far, and they will continue to do this. So please share any concerns with them. It's absolutely fine at this point to not be OK. If you do feel down, make sure you get in touch with people. Keep in touch with your friends, your family and your staff, and we will get through this. You all have the potential to reach your goals, and I believe in each and every one of you. So let's make the best of a bad situation. I wish you all the best and take care.